I italicize my sadness, does that make it more romantic? I hid by the light, absorbed what I could to gain strength. Now my energy grips bodies too hard. My defense mechanism carves its way out of chest. If I don't smile, I will be questioned. My job is to stay whole until vacant. Sadness makes its way in the bedrooms. Angst is lurking in the hallways. But happiness is supposed to amplify over this. But everything is static, loud, heavy, stitches still in mouth, choking on own words. To spill out is to lose. To lose is to admit. To admit is to say I'm not thankful. I'm selfish, that there is no excuse for this pain, that I did this all on my own, romanticized depression and became my own villain and victim in same breath. I am the double-edged sword, the middle of the Venn diagram, the line that forgot to be drawn, the body without the bones. And see how easy that is for me to turn myself into a blank space, to dissolve myself to evaporate, to solitude, to cry out for help and not accept what is given, mm. to turn my back, to not list failures out loud, because that translates to having even tried. More river. To destroy anything close to healthy, to work in progress, to skin pull the root, to ripping the band-aid off, to transparency. Mm. It is a scale. It is not knowing when to string up all the words to finish the poem before it becomes too beautiful, mm. too idealized, too much butterfly, and not enough chrysalis. Mm.